We haven't even discovered. And are they used in medicine and things like that as well? Massively. So our golden orb web spiders over here. Come on, mate. Go and meet your distant relatives. So we've got babies at the moment. Oh, I, can no. see the, I can see the web. So we've got a big web in here, and it's actually the web that we're looking at. So the web itself is being used as wound dressing. So we're trying to synthesize it, we being the grand entomological mm. world, or invertebrate world, um, to actually make a wound dressing. Because what the spiders use their web for is they use it to catch insects, mm -hmm. and then they wrap those insects in it if they're not ready to eat them. And it's essentially like an antibacterial cling film. Oh. So it stops them going off. And then when they're ready, they unwrap them and then they eat them and they, they haven't gone mouldy. Maybe this is the future of like food packaging. Yeah. Yeah. You know? Yeah, wound dressings and then onto food packaging. Yeah. yeah. So you've got babies in here. I can see a little one here, but I don't know if that's a baby little one and that's the actual... There we go. That's, yep, yeah, that's a baby. The, the big ones, we... We actually don't have a big one at the moment, but we had a big one until a few days ago and she was called Matilda. And these are Matilda's babies. And there's some at the little one there. You can see them. And what's this one called? This is called the Golden Orb Web Spider and it's from Madagascar. Yeah. A fascinating place. Yeah. And they're amazing creatures. They spin webs 10 metres across, across any sort of opening where there's an uh, air current flowing yeah. through. And then basically it just blows all their prey into their webs so they and don't have to do anything. And the the spiders. Are they in normally anything? flying insects? Mm. So anything they can catch in this web. Um, and you know, and literally anything that gets stuck in it, they'll have a go at it. Mm. 